According to a tweet by Praise the Steph dated June 30, 2023, photos have emerged showing Turkish armored vehicles, the Cobra II, near the Russian border in the Vovchansk region. This observation raises questions about the presence of these vehicles in the conflict zone, as no official information about the delivery of that type of vehicle has been reached between Ukraine and Turkey for the delivery of weapons. According to a tweet by Praise the Steph dated June 30, 2023, photos have emerged showing Turkish armored vehicles, the Cobra II, near the Russian border in the Vovchansk region. This observation raises questions about the presence of these vehicles in the conflict zone, as no official information about the delivery of that type of vehicle has been reached between Ukraine and Turkey for the delivery of weapons. The widely circulated images on social media depict multiple Cobra II vehicles in service with the Russian Volunteer Corps RVC, a paramilitary force fighting alongside Ukrainian forces. The RVC lacks official status and is considered an unrecognized organization. Although no official agreement has been reached between Turkey and Ukraine regarding the Cobra II, there have been previous instances of Turkish military equipment being present in Ukraine, such as the Bayraktar TB, two drones and Kirpi armored personnel carriers. The Cobra II is a versatile infantry mobility vehicle manufactured in Turkey. Used since 1997, it has participated in various conflicts, including the war in Afghanistan and the Russo-Georgian War. It can be configured as an armored personnel carrier, anti-tank vehicle, amphibious vehicle, reconnaissance vehicle, ground surveillance radar vehicle, forward observation vehicle, and armored ambulance. The Cobra II has a mass of 6,200 kg and a length of 5.23 meters. It has a width of 2.22 meters and a height of 2.1 meters, accommodating a crew of 1 plus 8 personnel. Powered by a 6.5-liter diesel engine, it can reach a maximum speed of 115 km per hour and has a range of 752 km. The Cobra II features a helical coil suspension, enhancing its capability to maneuver through challenging terrains and providing relative comfort to the crew. Renowned for its versatility and robustness, the Cobra II meets the requirements of military forces worldwide. To date, there has been no official confirmation of the delivery of these vehicles to Ukraine from Turkey. Ukrainian authorities have not announced any arms supply agreement with Turkey, raising questions about how these Cobra II vehicles arrived in the Vovchansk region. Turkey, on the other hand, has not publicly responded to these images and has not issued an official statement regarding the presence of Cobra II vehicles in Ukraine. The appearance of Cobra II within Ukrainian forces is quite surprising, raising concerns about the origin of these vehicles. Nevertheless, Cobra II remains an asset for the Ukrainian forces.